um, speak to you. And, and it's about relationships. It's about a relationship. It's about a relationship, whether it's marriage. For the most part of marriage or being engaged or uh, girlfriend, boyfriend, uh, boyfriend, girlfriend, however you want to phrase it, your man, your woman, I mean, you're in a relationship with one. Uh, uh, the thing that you need to do, and, and, and this is what I want to say when in a relationship, in a relationship because every relationship there's ups and downs in every relationship. If, if you, you, you're talking to someone and they say that, that they don't have no problems and there's no ups and downs in their relationship, they're lying. They're lying. Lying, lying, lying. Because it, it takes the friction that makes it grow. It takes a negative and positive to cause light, to cause fire. And so I will say that um, uh, God told the man and the woman, what I put together, let no man separate. So the, the thing that, that you need to understand, even in a marriage, when you got married, it was between you and that person. It was between you and that person. When you fell in love, it was between you and that person. And there are times when there are conflicts that happen, understandably so. There are times when conflicts happen, but in those times when conflict happened, the worst thing you could do is to complain to someone on the outside about what's going on on the inside because someone on the outside will never know what's going on on the inside what they will get will be a version your version especially if it's just you expressing or talking to someone the first thing you need to do when you have a conflict is is not talk to your family not talk to your friends, but the thing that you must do is to talk to each other. Because, see, the thing about it, even with conflict and even with, with a family, with a family, now, y'all might have a hard time, y'all might have a difficult moment, but one of the dangers in telling your family is that oftentimes the family, your family, mom and dad, they're gonna be loyal to you. And so they're going to be biased, and so they're going to have a biased opinion. And so, but the danger is in, 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 in you telling this while you're inviting them into your, your, your life or your business. What you're now doing is um, uh, you are not only inviting them in, but also the danger, the danger is in, in, in when you're sharing it, is when you do resolve it, and when you're better and you're different, you might be different. You might be better, but they won't. Because you might have moved on, you might have forgave, but they didn't. And so now you got that in your ears. And so the best thing is to keep it between yourself. Keep it between yourself. Or if you do need counseling, go to someone who's unbiased, particularly someone who uh, is uh, who's, who's uh, uh, professional, someone who's skilled, and someone who won't take sides. And so those are some words of wisdom that will help somebody today. And so that's a way to keep, keep down conflict. Some, some stuff to keep down is just keep it to yourself or deal with it yourself or take it to God. Or whatever the issue is, deal with the issue. Don't go around the issue. Don't talk about the issue. But deal with the issue. Deal with the issue in love. Deal with the issue in patience. The scripture says, as a believer, if you see your brother overtaking the fault, the scripture says, him that is spiritual, consider yourself. So in other words, check your spirit. Check your spirit when you're coming. Don't come in condescending. Don't come in uh, trying to make them belittle them. Because when you go in the wrong spirit, you're wrong. Because the scripture said you got to go with go go to them in the spirit of meekness. Meekness will restore them. None else. If you go in any kind of way except meekness, then you're out of the will, and you will not restore them. And so those are the words. It, it's it's your attitude. It's our attitude. It's your attitude will affect your altitude, your level, your level of growth. Is based on your perception. Those are my words. You feel me? 
Want me to close this door? Yes. Okay.